The Grand Canyon, renowned for its breathtaking vistas and geological significance, has long been a focal point for archaeologists and geologists aiming to unravel the mysteries of Earth's history. Recent discoveries within this natural marvel have provided profound insights into both ancient life and the dynamic processes that have shaped our planet. In 2016, a serendipitous event led to a remarkable paleontological find. A cliff collapse in the Grand Canyon revealed fossilized footprints dating back approximately 313 million years. These tracks, identified as the oldest of their kind in the canyon, were discovered by Norwegian geology professor Alan Krill during a hike. The footprints, believed to be among the earliest evidence of vertebrate animals walking on sand dunes, offer a unique glimpse into the behaviors of ancient creatures. The distinct arrangement of the tracks suggests a lateral sequence walk, a gait where the legs on one side of the animal move in succession, a pattern observed in modern-day reptiles. Beyond paleontological treasures, the Grand Canyon has been a repository of human history for millennia. Archaeological excavations between 2007 and 2009, conducted by the National Park Service in collaboration with the Museum of Northern Arizona, unearthed significant artifacts along the Colorado River corridor. One notable site revealed evidence of six distinct human occupations spanning 3,500 years. Among the discoveries was a complete kiva, a ceremonial structure used by Puebloan peoples, shedding light on the spiritual and communal practices of the canyon's ancient inhabitants. The Grand Canyon's archaeological significance is further underscored by the discovery of split-twig figurines. These delicate artifacts, crafted from split willow twigs and shaped into animal forms, primarily deer and bighorn sheep, date back between 2,000 and 4,000 years. Found in various locations across the western United States, including the Grand Canyon, these figurines are believed to have held ritualistic significance, possibly serving as totems or hunting charms. The intricate craftsmanship and widespread distribution of these artifacts highlight the cultural richness and interconnectedness of ancient societies in the region. Geological studies have also provided fresh perspectives on the canyon's ancient formations. In 2024, researchers utilized advanced tools to examine the Grand Canyon's 1.7 billion-year-old metamorphic basement rocks. Their findings challenged previous assumptions about the formation and assembly of these ancient rocks. The study revealed that different blocks of the canyon's basement rocks were buried at varying depths and later juxtaposed through geological processes such as folding and faulting. This nuanced understanding offers a more detailed reconstruction of the tectonic history that shaped the Grand Canyon's foundation. However, the preservation of these invaluable archaeological sites faces challenges. Decades of operations from the Glen Canyon Dam, constructed in 1963, have altered the natural flow of the Colorado River, leading to increased erosion of riverbanks and terraces where many archaeological sites are situated. The reduction in natural sediment deposition has left these sites more vulnerable to erosion, threatening the integrity of artifacts and structures that have endured for thousands of years. To mitigate these impacts, researchers and park managers are exploring strategies such as controlled floods to redistribute sediment and protect these cultural treasures. The Grand Canyon continues to be a dynamic repository of natural and cultural history. Each discovery, whether a fossilized footprint or an ancient artifact, enriches our understanding of the complex tapestry of life and geological processes that have unfolded over eons. As research progresses and new technologies emerge, the canyon's depths promise to yield even more insights into the ancient world, underscoring the importance of preserving this unparalleled natural wonder for future generations.